много пасмурно сегодня. A little bit cloudy today. Hello, YouTubers. My name is Nix V. You are on the channel for those who love inline skating and wants to progress in it. And today we will be talking about these things. These are curbs, and I will show you some tips how to skate on and off the curbs. We will start from the beginner's level. The easiest thing is, of course, a simple step on. That looks like that. It's very simple if you know how to walk. You should do it easily. You are putting all the weight here, raise the foot and all the weight here. As simple as it is. If you are not really sure in yourself, if you are not sure in your one foot skating, in your balancing, you can try to make it from the sideways. You are skating near the curb, you are putting one foot on it, feeling the confidence in that foot and only after that put in the other one. One foot and the other. The next one will be the step over with some small jump, like this. You have to be able to skate on one foot pretty confident because you will be landing on it, but that's not really difficult in fact to skate one meter or two meters on one foot. You should watch my one foot tutorial and you can also try some sideways variation. The next thing is a simple jump and it looks like that. I'm jumped over, nothing difficult. If you know how to perform a basic jump, you just use about 30% of your basic jump, a small swing with your arms, small jump, and that's okay, you are already on the curb. In Russia we also call it with a wonderful Russian word parebrik. I don't know why I'm telling that to you, but at least now you will know three Russian words. Putin, vodka and parebrik. These three ways, step on, step with a small jump and simple jump are the main ways to deal with the curbs. Let's talk about adding some style to your curbs. And the first one is uh, stepping on into a half remi. Looks pretty cool. Half remi is that move. And at first you of course have to be confident that you can perform it on a flat. And if you are confident in it, and you are making your step on pretty good, there's nothing else. The next one is performed from the side, and this is the crossover step on. It looks like that. So with the usual stepping from the side, you are using the leg that is closer to the curb. With the crossover curbing, you have to use the one that is far from the curb. Once again, hop, looks pretty cool, isn't it? Another stylish element is the 180 over the curb. It looks like that. So, of course, you have to be able to perform 180 at first, and after that, it will be very simple for you. And now let's talk how to skate off the curbs. So the easiest thing is to use your scissor position. Yes, I have a good tutorial on scissors and you can watch it. After watching and learning it, it will be very easy to you to go off the curb in scissors like that. Unfortunately, scissors doesn't work the other way. So I can't go up on the curb in scissors, but off the curb, very easy. Nothing difficult, but sometimes you have such thing 
a different of the levels of the surface and the curb when you are going off the curb and in that case you should use jump a simple basic jump will be okay like that okay nothing difficult but you can also use the hop of the curb i've showed it in one of my jumping tutorials the simplest way of jumping on skates and it looks like that so i'm getting my toes up in fact i prefer to use that way of going off the curb in city more than any others talking about the step of the curb i recommend you to do it a little bit sideways like that and on a small speed that will be okay for a beginner but be very careful with your weight because going down is always a little bit difficult to control your center of masses and that's all for today don't forget to hit the like button hit the subscribe button if you are not yet subscribed the you can also support me by using that super thanks button and share that video with all your friends colleagues and family i will return with new tips new tutorials new city vlogs and so on bye bye